Hello, hello survivors! Welcome again to Cat Eyes channel. Today I will review about the new purple core Crusted Eyes Plus and the golden core Howling Frost. Please stay tuned and make sure you like and subscribe first so you won't miss any new videos from me. Thank you! The theme of Dead Hike Season 16 is Brimstone Crisis. Seeing this, there will be many monsters with brimstone attributes on every floor. Therefore, in this season, two new ice attribute cores were also updated. The golden core, Howling Frost, can be said to be specially designed for that high season 16. Judging from the introduction, it should play a big role in this plot. There is also a purple attribute core, Crossed Ice Plus. The current way to obtain it is to clear the boss floor of the dead height. <laughs> you can get an Ice Plus core after clearing each 5 levels. This means if you can beat floor 150, then you can get 30 Ice Plus cores. A total of 45 cores are needed to upgrade to level 9, so you need to clear until floor 225. And you can get the new ice core in the school shop as well. Of course, you can use the general core also to upgrade. Just remember to get one every week on the exchange shop. Let's remove the accessories and chips and take a look at this core. This is the case without equipped core. And this one is equipped with the ice plus core. There is a 20% chance of triggering the crossed ice plus effect on each target. Causes 17% damage to the target and randomly bounces it to another target hit by the attack. Causes the same amount of damage and the chance of triggering the effect to brimstone infected is doubled. And it has a deceleration effect. After triggering ice plus damage, it will cause 17% damage to the current unit for level 2. Randomly bounce once to other target hit by this attack. The equivalent damage here refers to 17% of the normal damage caused to the current target instead of the specific value of the unit before ejection. Due to that high brimstone season, this core still needs to be upgraded. And you also can use it for a ray operation with brimstone infected. Now let's take a look at the Howling Frost. After equipping the Howling Frost core, the flame tower sprays ice mist. Each time the target is hit, a layer of ice mist will be stuck for 5 seconds and suffer the slowing effect. Start up to 3 layers. After reaching level 3, the target enters a frozen state that lasts for 3 seconds. Take 50% damage every second. Damage to non-players increased by 100%. The current number of stacks will be displayed above the target when causing damage to the target. During frostbite, continue to attack the target. No layers will be added. Now let's test it on the player. The damage is probably due to the 1 star. The bleeding effect is not good as expected. See? We still need to upgrade it. Now let's take a look at slowdown effect on the player. 
Do the solution effect seems to be the same as nothing? After stacking 3 layers, the movement speed is reduced by almost 15%. Overall, this core fight has less than 12 stars, relying on the defense. And here's the Holding Frost Startup Upgrade Preview. That's it, survivors. If you have any question of life after, just drop them in this video comments, okay? See you guys in the next video. Bye! Thank you!